Well, celebrations continue in Gilmer. The Buckeyes are the state champions for the fourth time, and tonight the school district and the community held a big celebration. Fox 51's Ashlyn Anderson shows us how much this win means to the team and the city. The best Christmas present you can have. Oh, the Gilmer Buckeyes brought home their fourth state title after holding on to a two-point lead against the Belleville Bramas. This group went to work. Uh, they came every day. They trusted their coaches. They believed in the system. They overcame, and they just continued to get better week in and week out. The school district held a pep rally celebration Wednesday night for everyone to enjoy and reflect on the season. Retired Gilmer ISD teacher and school board member Gloria King witnessed all four championships dating back to the Jeff Trailer era. We have a tradition here at Gilmer High School that we're winners. We have an attitude that, yes, we can. Loyal fans and alumni like Elwin Henderson discounting the haters. They were wanting to ride me out of town on a rail, ask me what I was smoking, that I needed to forget it, it wasn't going to happen. So needless to say, since Friday I've been going, I told you so. <laughs> While the football season was moving in the right direction, the entire city got shaken up in early November. Teammate Jeremiah Noble's mother and aunt were murdered. I kept playing football for my mom because I knew that's what she'd like me to do. The tragedy brought the team closer and more determined to go all the way. They were the reason you want to play like this. They, was, they gave us something to play for. You stepped up. You came, you came together. together. You, you stood together. together. That's, that's how life should look. Recognizing that football isn't just a sport on the field, but having a loving community to go through the fire with you will help you come out on the winning side. Ashlyn Anderson, Fox 51 News. At the pep rally, the Gilmer Mayor Tim Marshall declared today's date as Gilmer Spirit Day and gave Coach Metzl the keys to the city.